Hello, everybody. Let's talk about whether or not you are a bad person. Now, you can ask us and we'll tell you whether or not you are or if you aren't. Because I was wondering if I was a bad person because I purposely shrink the clothes my husband wears that I don't like. Yeah, and that's bad. That's a bad thing to do. They're not your clothes, Sharon. They're not your... How would you feel if he just went, you know what? I don't like that. I think he does do that. Oh, no, I, but does he say that to you? Uh, no, no, he doesn't tell me. He just, I think yeah, he exactly. purposely sabotages them. No, no. He see, definitely does. He's no, so that kind of guy. No, Sharon. You guys met Bryce, all nasty people. No, I don't nice think guy. you'd fight fire with fire. I think, uh, I think he doesn't do it. Hello, Nicola. Hiya. Now, you tell us your thing and we'll tell you whether or not you're a bad person. Um, so my partner has a t-shirt that he has had for like five years from an ex-girlfriend. Yeah. Oh. And Burn it. we've been together for three years and I have been begging him for three years to let me burn the thing. Burn it. Just do yeah. it anyway. Uh, look, Needs to go. Unle- look, unless... Get it caught on the... Do you know, have you got a clothes horse? Um, <laughs> yes. Yeah, get it. <laughs> Purposely get it caught on the side of the clothes horse where it rips the t-shirt in half. Oh, God. Sharon. Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah. Uh, uh, unless it it's might a, be an accident. Yeah. Unless it's a picture of him, like, making out with her on the T-shirt. I don't know about this one, because I've got a mate who's got a similar thing. He's got an old T-shirt, and it's his favourite band, and he loves the T-shirt. He wears mm. it often, but he, but he got it from his ex. But, like, he doesn't he doesn't have that connection, you know? Like, you know what I mean? Nicola, uh, do you like red wine? <laughs> oh, I do. I'm quite partial. Yeah, just walk along outside so you don't make a mess on things that matter, and uh, just accidentally spill the red wine all over the T-shirt. I'll have to get the clothes in while drinking a glass of wine. I think that'll do the job. Perfect. Let us know how you get along, Nicola. You guys, you guys should hang out. Kia ora, Hayley. <laughs> Tell us your Hi. thing and we'll decide whether or not you're a bad person. <laughs> um, I rip up my husband's T-shirts that I don't like and he can use them for rags. Dearie me. Oh, that's a, that, <laughs> making him use it for a rag is a little bit savage. Um, <laughs> what? But, I mean, do they, do they not go, just, do you reckon this will look good? You know? Sharon. Uh, yeah. Yeah. They look better with oil on them. Yeah, oh. I, I reckon. I don't reckon you're a bad person for doing that. You're helping. No. Thanks. No. Yeah. Uh, no. That's horrible. I, I like the. Um. I like the dryer idea. That's a good idea. Hayley, yeah, that's a if, good. Try that out. Try what if that he out. Loves that t-shirt. You know. <laughs> yeah, but does he love Haley that... more? <laughs> <laughs> she's the one that's got to look at him. What if she? She's, she might not be attracted to him. He's, he's the wearing, one who's that wearing it. <laughs> yeah. You she's wear yeah. what you're comfortable but in. But when you're wearing it, you can't see what it looks like. I have to look at uh, it. Haley has to look at it. But no, but you. So that d- defeats. Do you not look in the mirror when you, whenever you, you come to wear? Before you come to wear? Oh, yeah, of course I do. Give myself the double gun on the way out. Get out there, hot stuff. Have a good one. I smack myself on the bum. And I'm out. You got, yeah. that, it's, you, you got to be comfortable. Like, Bryce people, isn't doing that. People are comfortable Bryce get, when they walk Bryce out. Bryce gets dressed in the dark. He's not doing that. <laughs> he's getting up at four in the morning. He's, he's not doing that. Okay. Oh, Sharon, you are a bad person. Hello. Stephanie, tell us why you're a bad person and uh, we'll decide whether or not you are. Well, I don't think I'm a bad person at all. I, when I met my husband, he really needed styling. So I thought I could do it a sneaky way and hide his clothes, <sighs> or I could front foot it and just burn them in front of him. Oh, whoa, 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 <laughs> Stephanie, that, that, that is quite bad. Like, you're burning them. In. You're not even doing something sneaky behind his back. Like, you're just full-on savaging them in front of his eyes. That's right. Oh. That polyester went up in flame. Mm, okay, all right. This is Stephanie, horrible. that one's questionable. And oh finally, Ollie, I don't believe that you could do anything bad, but tell us <laughs> what you did and we'll decide. Um, well, for about two years, instead of paying for Netflix, I just create a new account each month and keep getting the free trial. Oh, no, that's just genius. That's just genius, Ollie. Ollie you're, the, you're the first caller on here that isn't a bad person. No, nah, nah. <laughs> but he's the only one that's doing something illegal. What, do you, what does that say about you, Jaden? <laughs> Jaden's like, yay! Oh, no, no, no. Yeah. No. Jaden yeah, no. just illegally downloads stuff. He quite often sends me links like, yeah. to stuff. Oh, it's like, gross. Oh, watch this. Yeah. You were actually meant to send me a link, Dan. You never did. Oh, I'll send it to you. <laughs> you always tell me you need it. Yeah. <laughs> we got scandal coming up for you next. Chrissy Teigen did something pretty outrageous on her Instagram story. And there's been a big breakup in Riverdale. Find out who next. Coming up in about seven minutes on the edge.